Hey everybody, it's me, Kai Mann, the author of 30 Day Notice, Abandoned Property, and the Pen to Paper series. I just left UrbanNationRadio.com, the studio, and I had an interview with Monica Marie Jones. And I, um, on the way home, was kind of just thinking and, and kind of talking to myself, but I do that a lot. Yes, I do. Um, but I was thinking about how my life is like turning out as I do often. Um, I'm quite sure you guys, you know, as you're, you're watching these videos, you're kind of probably seeing a, um, a theme going on, but I am just so thankful to the creator for the space that he has me in. When I say that I would not have deemed this or either thought of this for myself, I would not have, I would have never thought about, um, sitting and talking in front of people and um, asking questions and well I ask questions all the, all the time so nix that but I would have never thought to have done that on such a platform as urbannationradio.com I would have never thought of that and it's amazing to me how God kind of puts you into place where you need to be and his plans are so much better for us than we can have ever imagined for ourselves this is something I would not have imagined not not at all not at all and I'm so excited I'm so thankful for all the people that are around me that I, I see um, that help me to grow and that I'm able to just just watch them grow as well. It's amazing and, and I'm just so excited about life and about all of the opportunities and chances that I have been given over these past few years. Um, the Motown Writers Network has been such an um, affluent influence for me as well with, with my writing. But I'm telling you, there is nothing like the path that God has for you to go on and you just surrender to the path and not try and go run another way. So if it's something that you have been led to do, just do it. Even if it does, it's not something that you would have thought to do for yourself, it makes you afraid or you're uncomfortable, do it anyway. Open up, surrender, and be the vessel that God has called you to be. Peace.